If we can, come in, find our seats. Let's stand and begin to prepare to worship. Trust in your love In the darkness in the night When I'm starving for the light I know I can trust in your love Sing that again When I'm dry and thirsty, Lord And I'm crying out for more I know I can trust in your love In the darkness in the night When I'm starving for the light I know I can trust in your love. You keep. You keep no record of my sin. You don't remember all my shame. You keep. You keep no record of your promises I will not forget I won't forget your love I will not forget I won't forget your promises I will not forget I won't forget your love I will not forget nothing is impossible I will not forget I won't forget your love I will not forget Nothing is impossible, I will not forget, I won't forget your love. Your love heals every disease, your love that fills my every need, your love is everything, your love is everything, your love heals every disease, your love fills my every need, your love is everything, your love is everything. No record of mine. You don't remember all my shame. You keep no record of mine. It's gone. You don't. All my shame Your love heals every disease Your love that fills my every need Your love is everything Your love is everything Your love heals every disease Your love that fills my every need Your love is everything Your love is everything Moment. Come down, children. <laughs> hi, you came through the raindrops. You're here. Fabulous. How oh, hi, sweet Simone. How's everybody this morning? Wow, it's the fourth Sunday of Lent, and here we are, the faithful remnant. And we are going to talk about. 
God's mercy, God's grace. Anybody want to take a stab? What do you think grace means? What is grace? Yes, Angela. It can be a name and it's, um, it can be a name. it's God's grace. Absolutely, it's God's grace. You know, the book says unmerited favor. You know, we don't do anything to earn God's grace. He just gives it. And you know what? Everybody is included in God's grace. No one is left out. When we were in Saudi Arabia, we took a trip to Singapore with our two little kids. And my daughter said, you know what grace looks like to me? There was a world market and there were stalls of every nation, every kind of food you could possibly think of. <clears throat> and everyone got their food and we all came down to the tables and we sat there and we had dinner together. Every nation, every tongue. And our daughter was maybe your, your, your age, seven or eight, nine, whatever. And she said, you know, this looks like heaven. This is grace. We're all getting along. We're all sharing. And aren't we glad that we have a God who doesn't leave anyone out? We are all welcome to the table. His mercy and his grace are endless. Isn't that the best news ever? Oh, I love you guys so much. You can go to your school, school now. Oh, I'm the prayer? Oh, you're the prayer. Sorry. Would you pray with me? God, we thank you so much for the opportunity to be here again this morning, and we thank you so much for that grace, that grace that's so difficult to understand because you love us so much no matter what we do, God. We pray that you would help us this morning find ways to show that grace to other people too. In your name we pray, amen. Now you're dismissed, kids. <laughs> well, good morning. My name is Brian Edwards. I'm the associate minister of Family Life here at Cypress Creek. Christian Church, and we are glad that you're here with us this morning to celebrate and to worship. We invite you to, as you have a chance, at, at the end of every row, there's a black book, and we invite you to take a second and just to give us a record of your attendance with us here this morning. We would appreciate that. So now, as we do every week, we invite you to stand and to extend your hand, maybe extend a hug, and to greet one another this morning.
those who know and love God, among those who know and love God. A sense of welcome is desired almost more than everything else in life. And for those who do not know welcome, life is like a desert, barren and painful and hopeless. Grace is the characteristic within God that is welcome, an amazing grace that frees us to know the life-sustaining experience of divine welcome. Amen and amen. Amazing grace, how sweet the sound that saved a wretch like me. Oh, 
shall soon dissolve like snow in the sun for bear to shine.